Everyone will come back to uh, algebra. We are going to talk about the n value and n vectors of uh, matrix. And uh, we think uh, we have a, 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 a x equals to b and uh, We are going to tell that the x equals to g e lambda t. And lambda is the constant value. And the g is non, uh, is a non uh, zero vector. And uh, And we have a which call lambda is a, a value and g is a, a vector and a g equals to lambda g. And we are going to lambda is n value to a, then determinant a minus lambda i equals to zero. And uh, we are going to show this equals to a11 minus lambda a12 a1n a21 a22 minus lambda a2n amn a2m amn minus lambda and this determinant is zero. If G is a vegan, G is again vector to R, then X is G E lambda T. And it is a particular loss uh, solution to this differential equation G A X. We have indicated here that is X prime is differential equation. Okay, we are going to have a If uh, if lambda one to lambda n uh, are n values to a and g one to g n are n vectors to a, then uh, x. 1 equals to g1 e lambda 1 t and uh, xn is gn e lambda n t then x equals to sum k from 1 to n ck x k and x prime derivative is uh, some k from 1 to n ck 
एक्सप्रीम जे एंड दिस वन एक्सप्रीम जे फ्रॉम हियर इज के फ्रॉम वन टू एन सी के ए एक्स के विच इज ए आठ एंड इट कम दिस एंड इट इज ए एक्स एग्जाम्पल Example x prime equals to three x minus five one, and y prime equals to x minus three y. Then, uh, not x prime equals to x prime y prime. Not brush. No. Three minus five, one minus three. X Y and it is A X. Then determinant three minus lambda minus five one minus three minus lambda equals to zero. Then lambda two minus nine plus five equals to zero. Then lambda one and two equals to plus minus two. Then for lambda one equals to two, we assume g one equals to a b and a g one equals to lambda one g, and it is a. Uh, Three minus one by minus three. A B equals to two A two B, and we solve this, and we get that G one equals to five B. B. And for lambda one equals to minus two, G two equals to C D, and we get G two equals to one one. Then x equals to c1 g1 5 1 e 2 t plus c2 1 1 e minus 2 t and we put it here x equals to 5 c1 e 2 t Plus c two e minus two t, and y equals to c one e two t plus c two e minus two t. Okay. We know that also that uh, 
Tier 2 Ich wir habe If we have a symmetry, a symmetry, symmetry, then G1, then G, I is orthogonal G, J. Why? Because a g1 equals to lambda 1 g1 and a g2 equals to lambda 2 g2, for example, and uh, we get uh, we get uh, g2 a g1 equals to g2 lambda g1 and G1 A G2 equals to G1 lambda 2 G2. And we, yeah, we are multiply transparent. And we, We are going to transplant this is G2 transplant A because A symmetry A transplant equals A. A and uh, G1 equals to G2 T lambda 2 G1. Then this one minus this is given us uh, is given us zero equals to lambda one minus lambda two g two transparent g one. And uh, this is non-zero, then this is zero. G transpose G one equals to zero means that G one is perpendicular to G two. Another uh, method is that uh, A is a symmetry and uh, N, N, N matrix and has A N values lambda 1 to lambda N and uh, G1 to G N in uh, vectors. And P is going to be G1, G2, Gn matrix. And there is the orthogonal and P transparent A. P equals to D, which is diagonal of lambda 1, lambda 2, 
lambda n. And we are going to see this in uh, example and it is the we will search p so then that p t a p and the matrix will be uh, orthogonal uh, and uh, and it is a diagonal matrix and a is four two two one then take a minus lambda i equals to four minus lambda two two one minus lambda equals to zero then lambda one zero lambda two five and uh, for lambda zero we are going to have a g1 lambda one g1 is a b then four two two one a b equals to zero then g1 equals to a minus 2 a But G is a uh, orthogonal and uh, is and it is the absolute G equals to absolute G one equals to one equals to G one power by two it is A two plus four A two then a equals two plus minus one divided by square five. Then G one equals two plus minus one divided by this one minus two. And for lambda two equals to five. We have G2, CD, then, uh, then we get uh, G2 equals to 2 divided by this, 1 divided by this. I am fine. I am ready. One divided by five squared, and it is two one. But G one is the perpendicular to G two, and the P equals to one. This, and it is the G one one minus two and two one and p trans not a p equals to zero 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 five then we put here this one it is multiple by this okay
the last uh, segment is uh, how to make a diagonal matrix of a non-symmetric matrix. A N N non sim and uh, is a diagonal is diagonal if there exists a P inverter bar uh, in um, inverse inverse P with P inverse then P invert A P equals to D equals to D. And D is the diagonal matrix. Okay, uh, I am going to find an example. An example is here. A equals to 3 minus 5, 1 minus 3. And uh, uh, we are going to find the uh, 3 minus lambda minus 5. 1 minus 3 minus lambda and it is uh, equals 0 then lambda 1 equals to 2 and lambda 2 equals to minus 2 and uh, we get g1 equals to 5 1 and uh, g2 equals to 1 1 as we have uh, seen in a previous example. Then P equals to 5, 1 and 1, 1 is a matrix and uh, we are going to see if uh, determinant P P equals to 5 minus 1, 4 is not 0. Then P in Vash equals to 1, 5, 1, 1. And uh, divided by 1, 4. And uh, P in Vash multiplied by A. P equals to 2002 and it is diagonal matrix. It is D. Okay, it was all for uh, this, and we are going to, in the next uh, video, we are going to use, uh, see the usage of uh, n uh, values and n vectors in the, in the, No, we, uh, we are going to tell that uh, because it is not so too many, too much, only the usage of the uh,
Un baño es eh, if you have a matrix A and uh, with symmetries and uh, uh, polynomial Q, X, Y, Z and uh, the vector R, X, Y, Z then Q the polynomial is R transponal A R and A is coefficients matrix of the polynomial And we are going to and we are going to have a R equals P epsilon eta C and it is P S. Then Q is PS transponent A. PS is S transponent P transponent A. PS. And this is diagonal matrix. It is epsilon eta C lambda one zero 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 lambda one zero zero lambda two zero lambda three in uh, epsilon eta and C which gives us Lambda 1, Epsilon 2, plus Lambda 2, Eta 2, plus Lambda 3, C2. And P, P, equals to E epsilon E eta E C equals to I love you G1 I am honored Jesus I am honored I am very honored and thank you my love you my beloved Thank you that you told how it is. E epsilon equals to G1, E eta equals to G2, and E C equals to G3. Then we know that they are a transformations um, vectors. Okay. Okay, it is all about uh, this. See you in next uh, uh, video. We are going to talk about the uh, second degree uh, uh, curve and also in a space. We are going to study and also under uh, under a thing I suppose. Okay. See you.